Hey friends, today's video is on a highly interesting topic, carnivorous plants. Don't miss this as it's a very trapping subject that very few know. Do you know there are few plants that can eat meat too? Surprised? Let's understand how. Plants that capture prey such as insects, spiders and mites and eat meat for their survival are known as insectivorous or carnivorous plants. Most of the carnivorous plants are found in boggy areas where the soil doesn't have much nutrients. Surprisingly, they derive their nutrients from their prey and whatever little nutrients available to them through soil. Interesting to know that they too have a strong digestive system which helps them break down complex food items just like we humans. Now let's have a look at different types of such carnivorous plants. Pitfall traps. These are popularly known as the pitcher plants since they look like a pitcher shaped vessel hence named as pitcher plants. These are filled with fluids and insects yet attracted by the syrupy fluids. Just when they come to drink it, they get drowned and some plants even have a lid on them to trap their prey. Flyer paper traps. Some of the flyer paper traps have leaves covered with a sticky substance on which the prey gets caught. These plants also digest their prey through their leaves. Other type of flyer paper traps use tentacle like stalks covered with plants to trap and digest insects. Their stalks have digestive soup on them to absorb the nutrients. Snap traps. Venus fly trap is the most popular snap trap. Here the plant has a mouth like leaves that literally snap short when an insect or spider lands on it. There are some snap traps that are found underwater known as water wheel plants. They do the same thing but underwater. Bladder traps. Plants of this kind work in the most interesting way where there are sacs on the plants known as bladders that could create vacuum and suck the insect to digest it later. Lobster pot traps. Such plants first lower its insects with its sweet smelling nectar and once these insects are trapped inside, sees light sunshine through the leaves which look like exits. And to escape, the insect travel towards the light which is nothing but another trap. This is the plant's way to misdirect the insects to the inside of the picture where, it's, where it is caught and eaten by the digestive liquids. Hey, did you know? Some pitcher plants are so large that they can catch and consume even rats and frogs. Some carnivorous plants reflect ultraviolet light to attract their prey. Hey there, hope you liked our video. Before you go, please click on the like button. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel. Please hit the bell icon so that you don't miss out on any of our interesting video. Comment down below with what other topics would you want us to cover. Do share these with your friends and family.